beauties and welcome back to my channel and welcome to my vanity um so this is part two uh, of my last video i did a decluttering and organized with me through my vanity where i threw out a bunch of old expired makeup and i went through and i organized everything and rearranged things to how it would fit best for me so today i just kind of wanted to give you guys a little tour Let's go ahead and jump right in. I got my cafecito again. Okay, so in this first drawer, I have like my daily hair tools. Um, so I have my crimper, which is what I use a lot. My hair is crimped right now. And then I have my favorite curling iron. This is the Bio Ionic. Yeah, Bio Ionic Extra Long Barrel, so it's for long hair. If you don't have this, I highly recommend it. Um, I actually got it on sale at Walmart online, um, but it's normally like 140 or 30 I can't remember, but they have it at Sephora, they have it at Ulta, um, but I got it at Walmart and it was 75 bucks. Well, actually my husband got it for me for Christmas. Um, but it's so good. I love it. And then <laughs> I have all my scrunchies on here. I use these silk scrunchies when I go to bed. And then sometimes I'll just wear them around. Like if I'm going to Costco or going shopping, I just throw my hair up with a scrunchie because it looks cute. And then this is my hairspray. I don't use this one every single day. But if I am wanting my hair to stay and not move at all this is what I use but because I do have extensions and I can't wash my hair every day I don't use this every day because it flakes after the, the day you have to wash it and um, if I ever do need to do that I'll just wash the top of my hair so I don't have to wash my extensions and then this is the IGK mistress hydrating hair balm it's like the best well in my opinion it's the best leave-in conditioner and I've been loving it, especially with my extensions. And it smells really good. It makes my hair smell really good. And then I have my blow dryer and a mini brush. Sometimes I take this to, with me to work and just throw some in my purse. It's fine. And this next drawer, I have my hair drawer. Um, let's go ahead and zoom you guys on in so you can actually see. All right, so I'm going to be cut out, but oh well. Um, the point of this video is to you to see my vanity not me <laughs> so let me just get back um so i just i have a lot of hair products i don't know why i wasn't ever a hair person until recently but i've accumulated so much hair products my main favorite favorite products are in the front so that i can reach them easily and the products over here and in the back i don't really use as much i have some of course skinny serum love this um, then I have some argan oil. I use this when I wash. I uh, have It's a 10. I use this when I wash. Conditioning. Leave-in conditioner. These are my bobby pins. And then I have some other pin, hair pins that I got from Amazon. Some like cute, oh, some cute pearls. And then I have some other ones in there too. But I just keep them in there. Um... Then I have my everyday brush, hairspray. I use this rest weightless spray. It, it works good, but it doesn't last long. But it does the job for me with my extensions since I can't put like an extra hold hairspray because it flakes easily. Then let's see. And I just have like other products that I don't really use. But this thing, I think I got this thing at Ross, this little container thing. I got it at Ross, it was broken, it had like a lid, and it was broken, so it was like on sale for $2.50, and I just looked at it, and I was like, I don't know what I'm going to use it for, but I'm going to use it. <laughs> so I kind of organized, there's always hair in here, like hair just, it it's the hair drawer, so there's hair, so don't mind it. <laughs> but I have my hair products separated, I have um, hair ties, um, some pins and little clips and then I have all my big clips I also have on the bottom of this one little rubber bands to like do small braids and stuff and then I have this big donut that I never use um, and then my comb I just keep on top um, so moving on to the next drawer so 
this big baby is so hard to organize I literally don't know how else I can organize this in a better way um, so I just have I have a whole bunch of palettes um, this is the Jeffree Star mini breaker I have the Laura Lee palette um, I have Wander Essentials I actually wore this one the other day Colourpop Juvia's Alamar I love this one Alamar um, Huda I love this Huda Beauty palette my Jaclyn Hill vault collection um, this is actually stuff that I reach for every day um, and then I just have like minis like Huda uh, orange you glad celestial Thunder Dominique cosmetics naked palette that I don't want to get rid of because this was like this was the palette that got me into makeup like I was into makeup a little bit but this one was the one that got me creative and was like okay this is fun this looks stunning and I want to do this forever and that's the naked palette and it's literally so disgusting but I refuse to get rid of it because I love this and then my modern renaissance oh I love it same thing so disgusting but refuse to get rid of um, and then I just have some other random palettes in there and my big palettes are here I really only have three big palettes um, yeah Jaclyn Hill forever will be my favorite forever daily I probably should buy a new one um, just to get a better a fresher formula because this is probably expired I literally bought this when it first came out probably it's probably been three years and then this is the morphe which one is this dare to create palette uh, beautiful I use this a lot um, and then I have my James Charles palette I still love this one but it's not it's not my favorite anymore like I do love it though I love how it's like a combination of a bunch of colors and yeah I don't want to get rid of it so it's staying with me um, and then I just have a bunch of other ones I have my first ever Morphe palette that I ever bought and then which is the 35 not the 35 oh I think it's like I don't remember um, and then I have more Morphe palette my Kathleen lights palette I love that one to death I still would use that but it's probably expired I'm just keeping it because I love her and then next in here I have my glitter drawer I love this drawer so freaking much um so I have all my loose shadows here my single color pop uh, super shock shadows and then I have my eyeshadow bases Mac paint pot Morphe uh, P Louise base and then in this little drawer I have um, glitter sticks, glitter glue, glitter liners, and then here I have my Stila's, and then I put my Jeffree Star stickers underneath this so you can kind of see it every time you like pick it up, because I don't know what I want to do with the stickers yet, so until I figure something out, they're staying there. And I have back here some eye stickers, I just figured I'd put them in here because they kind of look like glitter, and then I have a face palette. <clears throat> In my top and final drawer, I have just, <laughs> it looks so bad, but it's organized, I swear. So this is all my face powders. I have in the back, uh, Pretty Vulgar, I have Maybelline, this is Becca, this is Ciate, Ciate London, this is Jeffree Star, Fenty, Fenty has been my favorite right now my go-to right now and I have compact mirrors I use these to put my lashes on and then I have some RCMA powder and these are my powder puffs these are clean and these are all my Jeffree Star mega highlighters they don't fit anywhere so they're staying there these are the liquid highlighters that I have and then all this section is highlighters I have Artist Tour, I have Colourpop, Fenty, Anastasia, MAC, Jeffree Star, Kylie, uh, makeup geek Ofra Ofra the bomb oh my god the bomb I wore the bomb on my wedding I think it's like Mary Lou yeah I wore that on my wedding and then Gerard cosmetics I think this was the first I think this was the first compact highlighter that I ever bought and it was stunning it still is I think it's called grace it's so pretty um, it's very 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 natural 
So it goes in the back because it's probably expired and I don't want to get rid of it. And then here I have my bronzers. I have, and blushes. So bronzers and blushes go in here because I don't have many single compact bronzer and blushes. I have most of them in palettes. So I have Milani, Too Faced, uh, Hoola, uh, this is Physician's Formula. This is the new um, Becky G collection. The, I forgot what it's even called. Hola Chola, I think. Hola Chola, yeah. Um, Becky G, but this is a bronzer. My friend gave it to me. It's super cute packaging, and I don't want to throw the box away. Um, this is the Bahama Mama, the Bomb, Milani, Juvia's, the Bomb, um, Note, Laura Geller, NARS, and then I have some. Whoa! Then I have cream blushes. So let's go to the other side. All right, so on this side, on my bottom drawer, I have all my bags. This is all my like extra makeup bags, my travel bags. Um, and then I also put in my makeup erasers since I don't reach for them as much right now. And then I have extra, since this is my like travel bag area, I put my travel Neutrogena wipes. And then here is my lipstick drawer. So I showed this on my Instagram. <clears throat> um, a while ago actually but I bought these little dividers at the container store they also sell them on Amazon they're like little slots that you can put on each other and they make these perfect squares for your lipsticks unfortunately stuff like the Fenty Beauty gloss and this I don't even know what this is stick it's too big for them so I just have them sitting here but I like to have my lipsticks organized not only by brand but by formula so over here on this side I have all my glosses I have two rows of glosses not much but I threw a lot away here I have Ofra my Ofra ones are probably going to be going back soon but I refuse to get rid of them because they're my favorite liquid lipsticks I love them so much and then here I have these are just random ones that don't have I don't have like a collection for I have uh, iconic dose of beauty I mean dose of beauty dose of colors um, Stila Kylie um, and then here I have all my Jouer ones these ones are really nice too I really want to rebuy these um all these i have literally all nudes and then here's like my all my jeffree star collections i have all the liquid lipsticks i kind of kept the crazier ones in the back green black red pink purple the orange gold those are the crazier ones and then i have like my nudes but i like to keep all my lipsticks facing upside down because i can actually see the color I am a blind person, so I'm literally like, Ugh, what does that say? <laughs> so I can't even read these names, so I just pull it up and be like, oh yeah, this looks like uh, the mystery shade, I think. Yep, it's the mystery shade, so I want to wear that one. Um, and then I have the bullets by him, and then I have my Anastasia collection that I just received, the undressed lip, lip kit bundle. And then over here I have lipsticks. I don't have many lipsticks, but... Um, yeah, I have a few, a very, very few amount. I have two ColourPops, and then one Maybelline, and then I just have MAC, MAC lipsticks. The one that's missing is in my purse. And then in this one, I have lip liners. I don't line my lips very often, but when I do, I use these ones. These are my newest ones, and a pencil sharpener, of course. Um, so that's my lip drawer. Next one that I have is my face drawer. Uh, literally this was already organized and in, in a way it was actually already organized I just didn't throw anything away um, so I just have in the back extra Neutrogena wipes and then I have my setting sprays and primers I have the elf cosmetics milk makeup um, hangover poor professional and then I have uh, this MAC Stroke Cream. I love this in the summertime. It's so nice. Lately I've been wearing it because it's been so dry and I just wanted to like give my face that extra moisturizer and glow under my makeup. 
and then here I have concealers. I have Tarte Shape Tape, um, ColourPop, Juvia's, Too Faced Born This Way. I love that concealer. Fenty, Jeffree Star, and then I have Contour, which is LA Girl or whatever. Um, and then Dragon Beauty. I still haven't used this. I don't really know how I'm supposed to use this. I need help. Should watch some YouTube videos on it. Um, and then yeah, just my setting sprays and I have foundation. I literally cleaned out my foundation and was like, you do not need 20 foundations. You need to get through what you need to get through. So I have my Huda Beauty right now. It's too dark for me, so it's all the way in the corner. I love the Huda Beauty foundation. It is super full coverage. It does smell strong, um, but I, I love it. I love full coverage. And then I have my Fenty Beauty, which is also too dark for me right now. Um, and my Too Faced, it's a little too dark for me right now. <laughs> and then here are my everyday ones right now, which is the Juvia's Place. This is in color Cairo. And then NARS Longwear Radiant. This is in color DeVille. I used to be in color Fiji. When I'm telling you guys, I am white right now. I am white. Like, I was a whole shade darker and I don't know what happened. <laughs> I go in the sun, I swear. And then I have this Fenty, the moisturizing one. I don't know if I'm a fan of this yet. I have to try it again. But the first time I tried it, I didn't like it. So we will see. And then here, I just keep my Clinique Take the Day Off and Makeup Wipes there. Okay. In this drawer, we have, I know I cleaned it, but... I'm wearing these lashes right now. These are Monroe's by Exo Abby. I absolutely love her lashes. Um, I'll show you the back. Follow her on Instagram. Um, so usually the lashes that I'm wearing for the day, I'll put the box in here and at the end of the night, I will put them back. Um, but here is all my liner. I decluttered a ton of liners, a ton of mascaras. I literally only have three. And then here I have my brow products and I have my lash products, my lash glue and tweezers. And that's it. It's so simple and I love it. And in this top drawer is my skincare, my daily skincare, at the moment skincare. That's what I want to say. Um, so I have toners in here. This one I'm trying to just get through. And then I have facial spray, moisturizers. This is my tool section too. Um, so I also have tissue because my nose likes to run while I do my makeup. And then this is my everyday, every every single day skincare. I have my moisturizer, my eye creams, my lip scrub from the Lush. I love these. And then I have um, lotion and moisturizer. And then here is my Cinema Secrets containers. I just have these here for when I need them. This is my tool section. And then also have this cute little ring box that my dad got me from Belize. And whenever I'm cleaning the house or I'm um, doing my makeup and I don't want to wear my rings, sometimes at night my fingers will swell up and I will stick them in here. Right now they're so loose, like I don't even know. I don't know. Um, but I'll stick them in there so they don't get lost. And then in my tour drawer, I have more tissue. I have this little face roller thing, the jade roller and tools, skincare thing. Nothing too fancy. And I have my little fan. Got these at the Dollar Tree. <laughs> All right, and that's it for the drawers. Let's move up and I'll show you guys what's on my vanity. So in the middle is all my brushes and I just keep my brushes organized by on the right side. Um, it's all my eyeshadow in the middle, the ones that I don't really use. And on the left is my face brushes that I use on the daily. They all need to be deep cleaned right now. I don't know if you can tell. They are nasty. Anyways. Um, and on the right side of my vanity is where I keep my deodorant, my lotions, and I kind of hid my deodorant in that little coffee cup that says I love you more. I think that's so cute. It has a little lipstick. My sister got that for me. 
Um, so yeah, that is what's on top of my vanity and then on top of my light. I just have a few things that I thought would look cute. I have this um, Jeffree Star nude bundle collection and then above it I have the P. Louise um, brush collection. I didn't want to throw away. I thought it was cute. It said become the ultimate threat. And then here I have the Mean Girls storybook collection and the newest one that got sent to me which is the fairy tale by storybook. Now going back this way, I have my purses, all my purses sit up there. Um, that sign that says Girl Boss, I actually got at Burlington for I think it was $10, um, total steal. And the sign Hello Lovely right here, I got at Home Goods. And here's where my perfumes are for now. Yeah, I just recently started collecting perfumes, <laughs> but my everyday favorites are the Juicy Couture Rosé and the YSL. Those are my everyday favorites. And down here in the corner in the back, I just keep all my camera tools, my ring light, oh, like my clips for my backdrops and, um, and the holder for my camera, this camera stand. And then um, that's the purse I just got for Christmas, so it needs to go up there. And then here I have my boxy charms, and then my mini fridge. My boxy charms, I need to film a little video, and then I will put them away in the drawers that they go in. Um, but yeah, that is it for that section. Let's go ahead and jump into the Alex Nine drawer. All right, sorry guys, it's gonna have to be at a weird angle. Um, in this bottom drawer, I just have my mirrors, I have some extra organizers, and then these are these are my Shane Dawson mirrors, the Jeffree Star, I have a Jeffree Star Halloween, a Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson, the pink pig, and the black pig, and then I just have this one that I got at the Dollar Tree, yeah, I got this at the Dollar Tree in my Dollar Tree haul, um, so that's the bottom drawer, and then this one is where I keep all my extra hair tools that I don't really use on the daily, um, but I still wanted to keep. I have Babyliss, my straightener, I have curling wands, a little blow dryer, and then a clean new brush. And this drawer is empty! Um, that does not mean I'm going to fill it with more makeup. Or at least that's what I keep telling myself. <laughs> and this drawer is all my um, other eyeshadow palettes. These are my bigger collection eyeshadow palettes. I have the Morphe Jeffree Star palette. Uh, this one was a beautiful palette. I have used it, believe it or not. It looks brand new, but I've used it. And then I have the Thirsty palette. And then I have the Jawbreaker palette. Um, I got this in the summer collection. And then, of course, the Conspiracy palette. And here it is. <gasps> oh! Goodness, I love it so much and then I have blue blood and then in the back I have all the Norvina collections I have Daisy and Marquez and then here I have an extra jawbreaker palette that I'm gonna give to a friend and then here is my mini controversy palette and in the next drawer I have my face palettes this is where I keep my actually just my highlighting palettes um I have the I took it out of the box because I used it today but I have the peppermint um frost palette by Jeffree Star also got that in my last mystery box I have the brain freeze pro uh, skin frost pro palette and then I have Ofra Ofra glow palette I have this Basic Beauty palette. This reminds me of Barbie so much. Um, then I have my Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is the Glow Kit. Oh my god, these changed the game. Do you guys remember these? I love this palette. I still love this palette. I'm not getting rid of it. And then I have this Huda Beauty palette. I'm still warming up to this one. I haven't played with it much, but I like it. I just, I don't know. I don't know playing with it still and those are my highlighting palettes okay so in here I have the Tarte Parquet Princess I've been using this one more lately and then I have the cover effects palette 
um, very pretty. And I have my Marc Jacobs bronzer. It didn't fit in in my bronzing drawer, so I didn't want to keep it in there. But yeah, this is fantastic. And I have Natasha Denona, the Bloom palette. I just got this in the boxy Lux, and then. My Alamar Cosmetics blush. I love this one. It's summertime, it's so beautiful. And then I have Betty Boop. This one I got on Ipsy. And then I have this Tarte Color Wheel. It's probably, it's actually, prob yeah, I, I don't want to say probably. It is expired, but I use it still. <laughs> um, I'm terrible. I believe in that if your makeup doesn't have mold, you can still use it. <laughs> Um, I love that palette. And then here I just have some singles. This is an Ofra blush that we got in BoxyCharm. I don't remember the name. And then this is like Rocketeer. And I forget which one this is. But they're, they're both Benefit. Um, and then in the back I have this Tardius Pro Glow palette. I do like the bronzer in here. I'm not a fan of the blush. It's too pink. Well, at least for right now. And then I just have this e.l.f. blush kit. I love these blushes. And that is it for my blush and bronzer drawer. And in this next drawer, I have skincare, my backups, I have some nails, I have, uh, yeah, just skincare. These are my backup lotions. And then I have this thing that's what I use for when I do my mask and then I have a bunch of masks in here and this drawer is all my skincare that I've been receiving from BoxyCharm just a bunch of skincare that I don't know if I'm going to get through but I'm gonna try all right and this top drawer is all my lashes I love this drawer it's full of my favorite lashes all my EXO Abby lashes, super dramatic lashes. She also sells these lash cases, and I got one not too long ago. Um, and it has she custom made it with my name on it. Oops. And it's a magnet, so you can just slide it off. And then over here, I have these are the only other pair that are EXO Abby. These two. These are the velour lashes that I got from Influencer. They're so heavy though. And then I got these Mama Mitchell lashes in four, 5D Luxury Mink Lashes. Crazy. These are Tati lashes. Um, my friend got me these. But yeah, uh, those are going to be a look. Alright beauties, so that is it for my vanity tour. Um, thank you guys so much for sticking around and watching this video. I really appreciate it. If you liked it, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. It really helps me out so much. So I would appreciate a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, please go ahead and do so. I plan on pumping out a bunch of videos this year. I am super serious about this this year. And last year I was too, but I had let life get in the way and this year I'm focused. So I really would love if you became part of my beauty fam. So just go ahead and hit the subscribe button because why not? <laughs> and if you guys have any suggestions or if you guys have any questions about my organizing um, ideas or any of my organizers that I have or if you have suggestions for better ways for me to organize, please do leave them down below. I would appreciate it so much. Um, and... <laughs> Thank you again so much for watching. I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye.